Area Lems distributes rice to non cut holders families in Tekelang Chun. MAC Joycing Durong inaugurates village signboard at Choto Lokindong. MP Horan Singh Bay honors best performing polling stations of Rongkhan constituency. A very good morning and welcome to Karbi Long Life with Jili Hansapi. Now the news in detail. With no respite in the search of COVID positive cases in the state, the total cases had crossed 4,000 mark with more than 50 new cases being reported on Sunday. Here is a report. Assam Health Minister Dr. Himanta Biswa Sharma informed that on Sunday, another 155 COVID patients were discharged from several hospitals across the state. With this number included, 1,960 persons have been able to defeat corona and return home. Despite that, the number of positive cases still stand at 2,078. At the time this report was filed, Assam has recorded a total of 4,049 with 8 deaths. Meanwhile, the minister also informed in social media that he has been ill and was diagnosed with kidney stone. Following his tweet, huge number of citizens have expressed their concern and wish him quick recovery. It may be noted that Dr. Sarma been working relentlessly since the outbreak of the pandemic in the state. News Text Report, Karbiang Long Live. Fulfilling his pre-poll promises made to the people of his constituency, MP Horan Singh Bey, who won the election in 2019, felicitated the best performing polling station of his home constituency on Sunday. The short felicitation event was held on Sunday at Doloni LP School. MP Horan Singh Bey, who won the Lok Sabha election from No. 3 Dipu SDH Autonomous Parliamentary Constituency, expressed his gratitude to the people of the constituency. The day's program has been seen as a kickstart of the campaign for ensuring assembly election in 2021. <laughs> Morenro Modi During his address to the media persons, the MP had also expressed his concern over the increasing numbers of COVID-19 cases in the Hills District and it appealed upon the people to be more cautious in their day-to-day -day activities. Awards were given to Doloni polling station, Lingding polling station and Borthol polling station at the first. Second and third best performing polling station stated Mandal President of Ronghang MAC constituency. The event was also attended by VDC Chairman Dinan Bordoloi, Ronghang Block BJP Mandal President Ronjit Teron, former VDC Chairman Mohan Inti, Baithalang Solans Chairman Robinson Teron, BJP West Karbiang Long Vice President Kabon Togbipi, and several others. Kabon Militi Sophie reporting from Dongkamukam, Karbiang Long Live. Let's take a quick commercial break. Stay with us for more news. MS Punctual Stationery. Just step in once and feel the difference. MS Punctual Stationery at Ronkela, Dipu Manjaro, near Don Bosco Higher Secondary School, Dipu, Karbi and Long. Where you will get all things available like groceries, beverages, and personal care items. Here you will also get necessary household items like electrical items, gift items, mixer grinder, table fan, ceiling fan, rice cooker, and many more. Shop to the fullest and get 5% discount on stationary items and 10% discount on household items.
Welcome back to Karbyanglong Life. With the objective of making it more convenient for people to locate and identify the village, a signboard set up by the Choto Lukindong villagers near the road was inaugurated by local MEC Joy Singh Durong in Umrongso town on Sunday morning. Choto Lukindong area in Umrongso town is one of the oldest Karbi village under Garampani constituency of North Kachar Hills Autonomous Council. But contrary to that, the village has been very little development. While speaking to the media, locals have highlighted the grievances of the mining affected people including lack of road communication, education facility, healthcare facilities, drinking water facilities, etc. Local villagers have warned of strong protests if their genuine and long pending basic demands are not fulfilled by the earliest. <laughs> On Sunday, local MSC Joy Singh Durong inaugurated a village signboard. During the event, the elected representative urged upon the locals to work unitedly to fight for their rights. The program was also attended by Garampani 3 km outpost in charge CM Singh Timung, Karbi Students Association General Secretary Dhan Singh Teron, Social Worker Lakpalama, along with Choto Lukhendong GB, Borston Ronghang, and several villagers. Linson Ronghang reporting from Umrangso, Karbi Anglong Live. With the aim of mitigating the effects of nationwide lockdown, the Tekelangjun Cooperative Lamps on Sunday distributed rice to villagers of the area. E.M. Raju Tiso was present at the distribution event. The distribution event started at 10 a.m. by the Tekilangjun Cooperative Lamps under Core Country MAC constituency and a food item was distributed under Atman Nirbhar Bharat scheme. Present during the distribution event include Tekelangjun Cooperative Lamps Secretary Sasanka Nak, Chairman Omar Jidingti, Gram Kendra in charge Mohan Teron, and several LEMS committee members. While speaking during the event, EM Raju Tiso reminded that maintaining social distance and hygienic habits, including proper hand wash, are important practices in the battle against the pandemic. He also urged upon the public of the area to continue their support towards government's effort in preventing its spread. <laughs> Samsung Inti reporting from Dongmukha, Karbyang Long Live. 16 poor students from Harilal Basti area of Dipu who cleared 2020 HSLC exam were felicitated today in the event organized by news portal Assam Time Post. The program which began at 10 a.m. onwards was held at Harilal Basti Kalimandir. The felicitation program was organized in collaboration with local youths of Harilal Basti. The 16 students who had cleared the HSLC 2020 were presented a dictionary and a little cash as token and encouragement for their efforts. Among the guest presents were Assam Time Post Deku Chief Kamarul Khan, Harilal Basti Kalimandir President Subrata Dev, Senior Reporter of Pratidin Time Sanju Bora and Senior Reporter Devajyoti Bora. During the event, guest speakers also shared valuable words with their students to motivate them for their future endeavors. Bikram Kro from Deku reporting for Karbyang Long Live. Well, that's all we have for this morning. Thank you for watching Carbion Long Live.